So here's another video of my 360. Here it is. As you can see, I had the VGA plugged in. This is just, I just wanted, I was curious to see what it looked like. So here it is. Looks a lot clearer. I mean, I know you probably can't tell on here, but it looks a lot clearer than it did on my TV. But that's because, I mean, my TV is component enabled, but not high def. There's my external hard drive. I'm serious. So, it's kind of just run right over my desk, but I'm fine with that for now. Just so I can see what it looked like. So, yeah. Let's see if I can watch it. Oh, this kid keeps kicking me out because I kept killing him. Go figure. So I just keep joining again. It definitely looks like it is not losing any quality though. Same server again, see if he does it again, I bet he will. They actually ever finish this round, but you can kind of see it from here what it looks like. It looks a lot better than it did on my TV, that's for sure. Almost quality of regular games, like on the computer. I mean, being my computer monitor, I play games like Counter Strike. Day to Defeat Source, Battlefield 2, those sorts of things. So it has that quality. Actually, this is a, a little bit better now playing first person. not exactly the best of this game just got it but it definitely looks nice and yeah so there it is I'll try just I could probably just switch right over and start using the TV to show you the difference but I'm not really in the mood to do it so yeah as the intercooler saved a lot of money as far as I mean to buy the VGA hookup I think it's like 15 20 bucks I'm almost positive but yep 30 bucks and you get the intercooler along with it and it comes with the optical out or the optical audio which is nice too so there it is yep